So the title of the exhibition for the Singapore Pavilion is Pulp Tree, a short biography of the banished book. So the key themes of the project, which are also present in this exhibition, um, are of course primarily and overtly book and library destruction. But that's really a cover for examining the propensity for violence in our species. Not only the violence that we enact on each other, but also on the way we silence, eradicate and censor our own and other cultures. Pulp is kind of like threefold, how we present it here in the Venice Biennale. It is the book and the film, but it's also including a paper maze, a kind of an architecture. It's really a long-term inquiry into the history of banished books, of missing histories, stories that have not been told. The book is kind of the heart of the exhibition. It is really placed in the middle. It's maybe the most physical manifestation of the work of the artist. It's also about the tradition of printing, of, of creating books, of binding books. The book in this exhibition is a sort of ordering of libraries and ordering of knowledge, but in a very intimate poetic way, in a way that sort of acknowledges a kind of complicity that I as an artist have in the relationships that I build with the people I work with. The storytellers for her are important. It's writers, it's poets, it's librarians, it's archivists, it's booksellers. So this is why we also have a film, Talking Leaves, that introduces a relationship between this kind of community that really cares about the knowledges that are embedded in books. Some of the stories are living examples of the issues that I'm tackling. I filmed in places like Anarchist Archives, and they're people who talk about the importance of archives as safeguards of democracy. But I also speak to people who have shadow libraries or pirate libraries, which are completely illegal. But it's a way to push back against the monetization and paywalling of knowledge. We wanted to have something that gives the lightness, the mobility that the book has. So this kind of paper maze, it makes visible how books usually historically have been bound and printed. You come in and it's almost like an envelope, so we hope to weave you in too, as an audience, to become part of this community, which will happen if you take a book with you.